How do you choose a realtor to help you sell your home? What you want to do is really listen to the language that they use when they're talking to you about how they find buyers. If all they're talking about is what their brokerage does and how much the brokerage offers, of course, yes, that's very important and it's necessary as well. But if that's really all they talk about when it comes to seeking out a buyer, then you could be dealing with a more passive realtor. You want an active realtor. If they tell you that they do additional marketing, even beyond that with through local groups online, uh, target marketing, social media marketing, if they're telling you that they will call other realtors that they have connections with and really be willing to pick up the phone and talk to anyone and everyone who they think might be a potential buyer for your home, then you know you are dealing with an active realtor. And this is so important because if that's the way that they operate, then their goal really is to help you find a buyer as soon as possible. In addition to this, make sure that they are going to be giving you professional photography and hopefully videography. Don't assume just because maybe your home is worth a certain dollar amount or because of what they already said, unless they stated that it was going to be professional photography, that you are going to be getting a professional photographer. Ask if they do videography. If you have a, a home that's near the water or it's a higher price and you feel like drone photography is also necessary to really help capture the surrounding areas, ask about that. Ask for them to show you listings that they've done so you can see examples of the photography. I cannot tell you how many homes I have seen that are high, even high dollar priced homes, close to a million, over a million, where it looks like they really just had photos taken with their iPhone. This is completely unacceptable. This is probably this client's largest asset potentially. And if photos are being taken with an iPhone, it doesn't look good. It really, in my opinion, makes a property look like it's more dingy than it really is. You want the professional photography to be showcasing your home in the best light. So do not assume. Make sure you know for a fact that you are going to get very good professional photography and videography services. That is my two cents. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Uh, if you are located in the state of Florida and you are planning to sell your home soon, let me know. My information is below. I would love to be a resource for you. And if you like this content, please go ahead, give it a like and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Have a good day. Bye-bye.